Hey guys, this is What's Up 2190 here with a um, pretty cool, exciting tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to actually write a program that will take a that will take whatever Fahrenheit temperature you, you put in and convert it to Celsius and um, s vice versa. So you're going to want to open Xcode. If you don't already have it, you need to download it from the Apple Store. And um, Start a new command line tool, C project. I've already kind of started it. So right, so for right now, just make your page your um, main.cpp page look like mine. Copy this. I name mine C O F T C. So replace this bit with it, whatever you're going to name your product project. Um, Yeah. So now they've got what's going on here. If you want to convert salt CS2 Fahrenheit. Press one. New line. And the reason why we're going to new lines is because if you don't, it's all going to end up on one line that's just going to look really messy. So, just to make it look better, um, one minute. Copy this bit. Basically, if you're not clear what we've done right here, we based, this basically tells the computer what um, terms we're going to use for our variables, C temperature, Celsius temperature, F temperature, Fahrenheit temperature, answer, and count is basically the um, default C++ command for text, but my Xcode always makes me type STD, count, so, if, so yeah, and, um, now what this does is tell the computer that we're going to make the user pick an option and um, So now, once you've typed this, go down, type case1, this basically tells the computer that what to do when the answer, when the um, user pushes number 1 on the keyboard. Um, so once you've got that, type std new text line. Type more. So basically that text is going to display. Oops. Um, now what we're going to do is we're going to type to the variable of this part of the equation to um, the C temperature. Now, because we're getting the Fahrenheit temperature from this, um, this it's telling us that the Fahrenheit temperature equals the Celsius temperature plus 32, oh, sorry, times 1.8 
plus 32. So basically the line tells the computer to take whatever um, whatever Celsius temperature we put in and then do this equation. F temperature, which is basically we've set up as being our answer, equals Celsius temperature times 1.8 plus 32, which is the equation for Fahrenheit. Um, now we're going to put a new text line in. So I did that. And uh, you kind of do want to put a space between the um, parentheses and the colon because if you don't, don't it won't put a space between the uh, answer and the S, so it just makes it look nicer. So basically what, what this line does is tells, tells the computer display Fahrenheit temperature is and then display the answer and then add that text box sorry put a put a yeah oh no wait sorry this is actually F10 so I'm going to be um, limit based and uh, now you want to type break here because if you don't what happened is what's gonna happen is the computer's basically just gonna keep going that tells it like put on the brakes so now we're gonna set up the uh, Fahrenheit Celsius conversion And uh, have temperature. Very well, this one. Now basically we're telling the computer is uh, that the Celsius temperature is F temperature divided by 1.8 right. minus 32 and for Celsius type STD count All right, now type, again type, break.
now what we're going to do is we're going to type the is we're going to type default. STD. And what that does is tells it like if if the user presses a key if the user presses the number of sides one or two, then that just tells them they picked it an incorrect option. Um, and break again. And I we want to go down here and type return zero. And now let's run it. Be sure to turn your breakpoints off. Yeah, you can actually take this answer one out. Sorry about that. If you want, welcome to C to F to C. If you want to convert, if you can it, yes. Oh, snap. I'm sorry. Let me let, go back up here. Let's put this in. Sorry, so I have to go back to the point. You need to do that, so I'm trying to stop it. Run it again. If you want, this is the output down here. If you want to convert Celsius to Fahrenheit, press 1. If you want to convert Fahrenheit to Celsius, press 2. So I'm going to try Celsius to Fahrenheit. Type Celsius temp here, 22. Fahrenheit temperature is 71.6. And now let's run it again, test the other one. Press 2. And it's, it works. So this. So I hope you've all enjoyed this, and this is What's Up 2090, and I'm signing off.